welcome back to our channel. I'm Cole Fire. And I'm Jeff. About to forget my name there for a moment. <laughs> Today we're going to be reacting to The Bangles Manic Monday that came out in 1986 and peaked at number two on the Billboard charts. Um, one thing that I was reading about this, which I did not know, um, Prince was known for writing a lot of songs that he let women do. Like, he just wanted to get under pants. Most of Madonna sounds like the the guitar in Like a Prayer. He does that. Um, he wrote love song with her on there, but they were also dating at the time. Okay, but um, in um, the reason that he wrote this song and gave it to um, the Bengals was he was <coughs> kind of smitten with Suzanne Hoffs. Um, and he was, after he had heard their album, he gave it to them to record in hopes that it would um, pique her interest in him, so to speak, as he said. But, um, yeah, we're going to take a listen to it. I've never seen this video before. I've heard the song a hundred million times growing up and everything. It was one of my favorite Bengal songs. And um, they were one of the first all female band groups too, so I just like the song because I give them credit. It's I got an upbeat tempo and everything, and it it is so. I think the reason why it is such a hit and it's timeless is because people that work can relate to Manic Mondays. So Manic Monday can be, but any that's other usually day for people. Week. Yeah, it could it could represent any day of the week whenever you have to. You get your weekend off or you get your couple of days off and then you have to go back to work and it's like, why do I have to go back to work? And then you're a little bit slower paced. You're trying to catch back up and build back up and get back into the game. So let's see how they do it. See if they give us any tricks.
Wow, that was an interesting video. God, I love the bangles. I just love the 80s. My God, it just takes me back. You know how you can listen to a song and it'll take you back to a certain time in your life when you were like younger and you were like doing things and you remember when they came out. That song takes me back since day one when I started working. But you know what? This is the funny side. What? I could have fixed a lot of her time. Because in the song she's like, these are the days you wish your bed was already made. Don't worry about making it. Just make it when you get home. Why You're going to get back in it again anyways. Second of all, she says, because it takes all day just to figure out what I'm going to wear. Me and you, what do we do? Or we whatever want. the hell we want. No. We, we were taught to get our stuff together at night, what we're going to wear, put it in the bathroom. We got ready, popped on our clothes, and we're done. If we felt like, okay, this shirt I don't feel like today, I'll just change it real quick. But I guess women are different from men because their coordination of colors is, has, they got more ensemble to match up. Well, they have to worry about how they feel. Yeah, they had to dress a certain is. way also back then. The skirt can only be so yeah. long. Yeah, pencil skirt had to be a... It's where, you you know, couldn't men, wear the heel, high heels so high. The men, it, they just had to worry about slacks at... Slides, All I had to worry about was a suit. sleeve shirt and a tie and possibly a jacket. Yeah. So. But. You know. no, I just love this song because it's just like. I used to remember locking myself in the room with the big old stereo and pretending I was Susanna Hoffs and I was like part of the Bengals and I just get in there and sing. Which I did with a lot of artists. Did, did you own a, um, a, a banjo? Not a banjo. Um, what's the thing called? You're thinking of Deliverance. No. No, the, the, the round thing with the little thingies on the side. The round thing with things on the side. You know, the thing that they get. I don't know what it is. I'm having a brain freeze. <laughs> the tambourine? Yeah, that thing. Did the you thing that you that? put on your hip? Yeah, no, you know, I didn't own okay. any musical instruments. I just took a hairbrush and that was my microphone. Hmm. I didn't know how to play instruments. That I, I don't need a hairbrush. But... I felt like I was like, I'm the lead singer. I'm going to be singing. Y'all do the rest of the work. And, you, and, you, but, and your stuffed animals behind you were your backup? Yeah. <laughs> you know, like Rose from Golden Girls? Yeah. Okay. Um, no, but I like the song too. So. I was like one of those gay men that um, <laughs> most guys had pictures of the teen boys on their wall. I was the one with... The Bengals and Cindy Lauper and Madonna and Cher and I appreciate women okay. more than most people do. I was the straight day. Yeah, and I was one of those that I just I like women that can get out there and put themselves on the line and they can make it happen. And you know, people always say that women are the weaker sex. I don't think, I don't believe that for one moment of my life. No. If it wasn't for women, there would be no men. If you think about it. No, think right? about it. Every time a man has a problem, what do they do? They complain to their wife. The wife says, I understand, love. You know, I would do this, this, and this. And don't tell me what to do. And then they turn around and do exactly what they said. So, you know. Well, it's uh, like, where I think where, where was I heard it from? It was Design and Women, where Julia Sugarbaker, she's like, if if you have a problem with women, look what men done. Men have started the wars. They have started the sexism. They, they started, they created all this Thank you very much. for the women to, for the women to jump into that pool. Mm -hmm. And then they degrade them for trying to accomplished more than the men did but yeah but that was the bangles i know we were ranting all of it today yeah um, i don't know how, how we ended up on that topic but um, that's all right well you know one thing leads to another and uh, that's that's why it's a video reaction so. but that was the wonderful bangles uh manic monday and we hope that you enjoyed it i really did luckily today's only saturday <laughs> yes <laughs> Well, thank you. Hit like, subscribe, and comment. Um, yes. And we will see you next time. Peace out.